Hey everyone and welcome back to the Chris Carver channel. Okay, we're doing a second egg cutting video today. It's actually at night, so I don't have a whole lot of lights on, so I got this little extra light right here. Okay, the parents for this one, I'm really uh, looking forward to opening this clutch because uh, I've never produced a spied or a banana pied. And this clutch was, the, the mom was a het pied, 100% het pied, and I bred her with two males, one was a spied, a spider pied, and the other one was a banana head pied. So this could go either way. I am really hoping for a banana pied, but if I get a spied, I will be thrilled because I've never hatched out either one of them. I've hatched out head pieds, pieds, and banana head pieds. I've never got a banana pied, and I've never got a spied. So without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and get the trust. Now look, this one right here. It's got me thinking because that one kind of looks it's a little window it kind of looks like banana and this one's pipped but it looks dark I don't know so I'm gonna go ahead and pop this one open because it's the first one that pipped looks a little dark in there but let's go ahead and see what we can do here I gotta get a peek I'm sorry Okay, well, it definitely looks like pied. Sorry, that thing's kind of hard to cut through. I want to cut the baby in there. Those things are rough. Okay, wow, that thing was tough. Sorry about that. Well, it's definitely a pied. Oh my gosh, am I going to get... Is this a spied? Oh, well, I see a brown tail, so that's kind of, wow, this is, oh my goodness. Could it be, I'm sorry, I gotta open this up just a little bit more because I'm, I'm, I'm really, really anxious here. Let's see what else we got here. It's definitely a pie and I'm very happy with that. Okay, well, let's see here. Oh, but it's definitely a pied. Okay, so it's a pied. Not a spied, but a very cool high white pied. Look at that. That is awesome. I'm gonna cut this for a minute and get some better lighting. Okay, sorry about that. Had to get a little bit better lighting here so you guys can see. But this is a very high white pied. Very happy with this one. Very cool. I'm going to put you aside there, little guy. And we'll go with this one. That was the only one who pipped. So the parents could still be a spied or a banana head pied. Still haven't figured out who the dad was. So let's open this one up. If we find a spider anywhere, we know who the dad is. If we find a banana, we know who the dad is. I'm really hoping to find a banana. I don't think it's going to be in this one. All right, well, there we have a normal. So, still don't know who the dad is. Because it, it could be 100% head pied if we find a spider pied or a spider in one of these eggs. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and take a look at this one. One high white pied to one normal. Let's, let's get these odds going, shall we? See a pied, no doubt in my mind. Oh my goodness, look at that. Another high white. Now, okay, get off me. Now, I see blotch, okay? So that is another high white pied. Wow, very, very cool. Two high white pieds to one 
possible head pied. We'll have to wait and see. Okay, let's take a look at this. We need that spied. We need that banana pied. Come on, we got to do this. Looks a little dark in this one. I'm really starting to think that the spide is the one that did this. Okay, there's another normal. So we have two, two and two. So far, even up. I'm, I'm guessing it's the spide as the dad. But a banana would definitely be a cool thing. Well, banana pie would be the best thing for me, but these guys are all looking cool no matter what. And I'll make sure they all go to good homes. So, oh, look at this. Yeah, there's, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my God, I got nervous there. It's definitely another high white pied. There's another very, very high white pied. Oh my goodness. Look at all the white in these things. That is awesome. Oh my God. I've hatched out some pieds, but they were blotchy, little little white blotches. They, I don't think I've ever hatched out a, a white, a sol, like a really white pied like that. Those are so cool. You guys are cool too. Don't worry about it. All right. Let's get this guy going. Aiming for that spider banana pie. Come on, we got to get one of those guys. Tell me who the dad is. I see some white. You guys see that? Oh, yeah. Killing the odds so far. Killing the odds. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Look at that. A very, very nice, cool pied. Look at that. Not as high white as those, but these are actually my favorite. That and spides. But I, who doesn't love pieds? I mean, you hatch out pieds, man. This is a great feeling when you hatch out pieds. That is a very cool snake. Like you guys. Oh my goodness. I'll we'll put you right there in the middle. And you guys are cool too. I know I said that, but you guys are cool. All right, here we go. This is a big one here. Okay, still looking for that spide or banana pie. Come on. Who was the one who fathered this clutch? What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? It's looking pretty normal. If you guys got a peek of that yet. Yep, there's another normal. Okay, so we have three normals. Four pies. Are we gonna go full even up 50-50 or what? Or is this gonna be the gem? Is this gonna be the gem of all gems? Let's see here. Spider banana pie, come on. I take another pie though too. Looking pretty dark in there. Not sure if this is gonna be a it's looking pretty dark. Look at that. Another normal. Exactly 50-50 odds. So I'm guessing if these all come out with the head pied markers, I'm gonna take a wild stab and say the spied was the father. I'm, I'm, I can't believe we didn't get any spiders though, or no spies. That's wow. And if it was the banana head pied, I can't believe we didn't get any bananas because my bananas that I breed breed low, just loads of bananas. So this is gonna be one of those head scratchers, man. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. See them all come out. Maybe it'll give us a little more clue of what they, of who the dad was. But uh, if you guys have an idea. Which one do you think it is? Do you think it was the banana head pied? Or do you think it was the spied father? 
let me know. Comment below. And be sure to share, like, and subscribe. Uh, you know what? Don't do that yet. I'm going to hold off until these guys come out of the egg, and I'm going to let you see them uh, out of the egg. So don't go away. Uh, I'm going to wait a few days, and I'm going to continue this video. So stay put. Hey, everyone, and welcome back. Uh, for me, it's been three days. For you, it's been like five seconds. So an update on this clutch. They are out of the egg. They have not shed yet, but they are out of the egg. I'm going to show you I had four 100% het pieds. I am 99% sure that this came from the spied uh, times my head pied female. I'm 99% sure that's what happened because I also bred a banana head pied to her, but there are absolutely no bananas. And you know what? That just, that just tells me that the spied took over. So we got four head pieds here, as you can see. This is before shed. So I wanted to show you those first. They're really fat too. I like these little fat guys. Okay, come here. And I'm gonna show you the other stuff. All of these are high white, mostly high white. This is probably the, the least white of all of them. There's my first pied there. Okay, and we got this guy or gal right there. We got one trying to escape on me. This one right there. And then I got this one right here. So we got 50% odds, four and four, which is pretty cool. Uh, that doesn't bother me at all. I love hatching out pies, as you can see. Pies are just super cool because you never know when you're going to get the certain patterns. Like this one here that's got the yellow orangish on the outside. And this one here is it's got the dark black and there was no black pastel so this is not a black pastel pipe and you can see the amount of white on these guys uh, the last pies i produced had more pattern than white uh, they still had a lot of white but they were more patternish these guys right here are super super cool and i noticed on one of them let me see if i could show you oh there you go it's kind of like a Kind of a little bitty emoji. I thought that was pretty neat. Kind of, he's got a kind of like a, got a lazy eye or something going on, but very neat indeed. And I'll probably do a update as soon as these guys shed, because of course, those of you who breed ball pythons know that once they shed, they look absolutely stunning. But these guys, I'm just so proud to have these guys in my collection right now. And they will be put up for sale but for now we're gonna get some food into them and get them to shed and probably do that next video so that's what i got <clears throat> tomorrow or the next day i'm probably going to do the video of my mojave uh clutch which was mojave to pastel banana that'll probably be the next egg cutting video coming up so look for that but in the meantime, there we have it, folks. Four pieds, four het pieds, and the pairing was het pied to a spied male and a banana het pied, but I'm pretty sure the spied did his job here. So anyways, there you have it. Be sure to share, like, and subscribe to my channel. And if there's anything you want to see, be sure to comment down below. And we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.